Hello, hello, hello. Hi, hi, hi. This is Ms. Carr and welcome to Learning Physics. So in this video, we're going to study on how to plot the light rays in spherical meters. So what are these spherical meters? These are the concave and the convex meters. So to start with, let us have first the concave mirror. So concave mirror allows the light rays to converge, meaning ginatipon niya ang light rays. And we have here the object and the focal point which are in a relationship. So since ma-plot kita sa atong nga ray diagram, so ang may ari kasi si Miss Ginhibo nga palatandaan para sa inyo tanan. Para kung may boyfriend ka mo or may girlfriend ka mo, matandaan nyo. Nga, ah, okay, kung in a relationship kami gali, meaning we are using concave mirror. And there it is for our concave mirror. So always remember that the concave mirror, in concave mirror, the object and the focal point are together. So muna siya nga ginhambal ni Miss nga in a relationship sila, kay together sila. If you're going to take a look here on the curve, here, ari siya. So, up the nai sa isa ka lugar, si object kag si focal point. Isang bulubalis ka doon ta pa na ang bilog nga kalibutan of the nine na sila nga dua. Okay? Sige. So, for us to know how to plot the light rays in the concave mirror, let us have here our example. So, we have here an example wherein um, the object and the focal point are together, but then in terms of the length, so we have here the focal point. So the length between um, the focal point and the mirror is called as the focal length. So focal length is shorter compared to the object distance from the mirror. Okay, so always remember na mag, mag plot kita gani some light rays in mirrors, we have the pattern straight, tiko, tiko, straight. So always remember maghamba gani straight. It is the light rays nga parallel sa optical axis. And once magtiko gani, per me na da, naga align ang pagtiko sa light rays kay focal point. So let me show you on how to plot the light rays. So again, we're going to follow the pattern straight, tiko, tiko, straight. Again, straight, tiko, tiko. So here it is. So for our first light ray, we have here the straight. Okay, that's straight. So, always remember nga ang light rays nagahalin per me sa kay object. So, this is for our first incident ray. And there it is. And then, that's for our first incident. Since ang aton nga mirror, gina-reflect niya ang light, meaning ma-bounce back na niya. So, sa pagtiko niya or sa pag-bounce back niya, please take a look at here. So, ari siya. Kaniyang pag-bounce back. Okay, I told you what. Sa kaniyang pag-bounce back, ano siya? Naglabay siya or nag-pass through siya kay focus or kay focal point. So that's for our first light ray. So let us have the second light ray. For the second light ray, the pattern there is tiko straight. So, pag tiko niya, makadto siya kay, kaya makadto, makadto siya kay focal point. Okay, so. Okay, and then tiko, and then we have your straight. Okay. So, there it is. By the way, I used here um red and green colored pens para ma-determine kung sino si first light ray and then sino si second light. So, there it is. Now, if we're going to take a look here, diri nag-X or nag-tabuay ang ato niya light ray. So, therefore, dira mo na da siya ma-form ang image. Now, for that image, we have... Me. 
Okay. Okay, so there. So, kulantawanta, we have here the image which is located on uh, below the optical axis. Okay, it is inverted. Okay, and if you're going to take a look here, this is quite smaller compared, quite shorter na siya compared sa atong nga image, uh, sa atong object, I'm sorry. Quite um, shorter compared to the object. Okay, and there, this is located on the object side. So, sige, so what type of image na di siya ang atong nga na form using, using our concave mirror? So, let me write it here. I'll sing it. So, what type of image? So, since the image is located below the optical axis, meaning it is inverted. Okay. Next, the image is a little bit smaller compared to the object, meaning. And, always remember. If the image is located on the side of the object, or if the image is located um, sa kung diin gatindog ang object, so meaning real na siyang aside. So therefore, our image. So another another way man para matandaan nga real ang aton ni image if the image is inverted. Basta ganin, nag-invert ang image, meaning real na siya. So this is it. We have inverted, reduced, revealed. That's for our first example. And take note, in this example, we have a shorter focal length compared to the DO. Okay? So there. Now, let us have another example. That's for our next example. So this here. This is also an example of a concave mirror. So even though nagbalis ka dani ang focal point kag ang object still concave mirror sila. Why? It's because in a relationship gyap bon si um focus or si focal point kag si object. So let us plot here our ray, light rays. So magplot kita gani light rays this same gyap po ng pattern straight tiko tiko straight. We have your straight And sa iya nga pagtiko, sa iya pagbounce back, always remember nga mag-pass through na siya ay focal point. First light ray. So straight tiko, and then we have your tiko. Sa iya nga pagtiko, always remember nga kada tiko is always aligned to the focus or focal point. But then, since ang atong na light ray, mabunggo, hindi na siya sa mirror, hindi na siya mag-atras. Hindi na siya class mag-atras. Mabunggo na siya. Kaya kakad to, ganit sa mirror ang atong na light ray. But then, kung nantawon ta siya, nagatupo na siya gihapon kay focal point. Okay, so, straight tiko, tiko, straight naman. So there, straight. So if we're going to take a look with uh, in our light rays here, wala may nag converge. So what are we going to do is we are going to extend. We are going to extend. I'm oh, sorry, get uh, like we're going to extend the reflected rays. Okay, so in mirrors, the only nga may karapatan nga mag extend are the reflected rays. Okay, so kung hindi siya reflected ray, meaning wala siya right mag extend. Wala siya titulo also. Okay, here. Extend, extend. So the broken lines here are called as the side lines. They are the side lines. Okay, so there you can see, may nagtabuay na nga side lines. So kung di inag-converge yan yung side lines, meaning dira mo na siya ma-form ang E. So here. Now, in this example, we have shorter focal length, uh, shorter, sorry, shorter D sub O or object distance compared to focal length. So what type of image um, was formed by our concave mirror here? So this is 
located or the image is located above the optical axis, meaning it's Okay, and then the image is bigger compared to the object, meaning this is enlarged. And the image is located on the opposite side some object. This is the object, this is the image. It is located on the opposite side of the object, meaning it is a virtual. So there it is. That's for the concave mirror. Okay, now let us have here the convex mirror. For the convex mirror, so whenever that you and your boyfriend nag break up, meaning you are already using convex mirror. Okay, again, you are already using convex mirror. Because in a convex mirror, the object and the focal point are no longer together. Meaning, ang isa dira sa ilal, we have there the focal point, which is ara sa gyapon sa sulod sa curve. But then, ang object ara na siya outside. Meaning, si object nagpaubayi, nanda siya class, nagpalayo, nanda siya kay focal point, kaya nagbreak na si mga doa. Okay, so they are no longer together. They are no longer in a relationship. So, kung nagbulagay, kung muda paminsara lang, na hindi ka dapat madipress, kundi ang paminsaron mo, nga no, mega ka-learn ko. Once magbulagay ta, I am using convex mirror. Okay? So, imbis ka na magtuwala, imbis mag-subo ka na, na i-make use mo na siya. Ah, okay. I relate ko na lang siya sa physics para kumu. Okay, so there it is. So, bisan suli-suliun pa na ang bilog na kalibutan kung lantawon ta. So, hindi na ginaya mag-updanay si object ang si focal point. But always remember that ang ara per me sa sulod sa sulod sa curve si focal point even though magwa na da ang object still si focal point always kina siya dapat sa sulod sa curve sa atong nga mirror okay sige now let us have here the ray diagram oh sorry gati ko siya let us have here the ray diagram for the convex mirror now if you're going to take a look here in our example we have here Shorter focal length compared to the DO. Now, paano ta ni siya miss i-plot? Always remember nga in mirrors, we have the pattern. Ano to gani? Straight, tiko, tiko, straight. So, kung paano kita mag-pattern in concave mirror, the same na siyang i-pattern natin kay convex mirror. Okay, so let us start with our first light ray using our red colored pen. Okay, so straight, tiko, tiko, straight. So, we have your straight. First pattern natin, straight from the object, straight siya pa ka to the recent mirror. Always remember nga ang light ray halim sa object, ma-reflect goon siya sa mirror. Or makadto siya ganit sa mirror. And after that, ma-reflect siya, ma-bounce back. So sa kanyang pagtiko, always remember nga sa kada tiko, sa atong nga light ray, always nga siya aligned to the focal point. Okay? Okay, sige. So, atong light ray, oh sorry, this is for our reflected ray. So, ang reflected ray natin, alita, sa reflected ray, i-extend ta na siya going to the focal. Naka-align na siya kay focal point. Okay, next. Let us have our second light ray. We have Tico straight. So, sa iya nga pagtiko, kinangalan, align man siya giyapon kay focal point. Tiko siya. Sali siya, tiko. Pero, hindi na siya maglusot sa mirror. Kung di asta, landa siya sa mirror, mabunggo, tiko. Pero, kung lang tawon ta, align siya giyapon kay focal point. So, that's for our second incident. And then, straight. Mas straight na landa siya. So, straight. Straight, tiko, tiko, straight. Okay, so para pa, tiko. Ano ako na? Para straight. Okay. So, if we're going to take a look here in our ray diagram, the light rays do, do not converge. So, I am going to extend the sight line for the second light ray. So, here it is. 
And this is where the light rays converge. Okay, so the sight lines. Sight lines not converge. We have here our image. Okay, so what type of image was formed by the convex mirror? So this is located above the optical axis, meaning the light. Next, this is smaller compared to the object, meaning this And this is located on the opposite side of the object. This is the object. This is the opposite opposite side of the object, meaning virtual. So, muna siyang atin nga. Okay, so I hope you clear lang siya. Okay? Okay. Okay, now let us have another example. In our next example, we have here, by the way, we have shorter focal length and longer view. So, our object is. In our second example, we have here, Shorter DO or object distance and then longer focal length. So, ano naman na siyang pattern? The same gihapon ng pattern, straight tiko, tiko, straight. So, kung anong ginhimo tayo in our previous example, the same ang yahimo on the So, let us plot here our ray diagram. Our light rays in the ray diagram. So, we have here straight tiko. Okay, straight. Huh? Straight. Straight. So supposedly, I had this mirror. Okay, straight. And then matiko siya sa iyang pagtiko, kinalan alay focal point. So, okay. So I'm going to extend the reflected ray. So again and again and again, only the reflected ray has the right to be extended. And, okay. Next, for our second light ray, for our second light ray, we have here the green colored pen. So, tico straight. Straight, tico, tico straight. Okay, so tico, tico, tico. Okay. Okay. And then we have your. Okay, so there is. Okay. So, wala liwat may nag-converge na light rays. So, extend taliwat ang ato niya. Sight. Or ato niya reflected rays. So, kung lantawanta, we have here the location wherein the sight lines meet with each other. So, here is for our so the image is located above the optical axis, meaning this is upright. It is this is smaller compared to the object, this is reduced. And this is located on the opposite side of the object, therefore, this is virtual image. So mula ni siyang tandaan when using convex mirror. If you're going to take a look. In convex mirror, it always forms a bright, reduced, and virtual image. Regardless, kung sino mas man mas laba ang measurement, is it the object distance or the focal length? So always a bright, reduced, and virtual image. Nasa ang iyang gina form. Okay. So that's all for our. Um, plotting of ray diagram in mirrors. So, um, in plotting ray diagrams in lenses, so please watch the next video.